Good morning, everyone. My name is John Waters, and I have the great joy to serve as lead pastor at First Baptist Church Statesboro. And these daily videos are part of our church's 40 days of prayer and dialogue where we're discerning God's will about how to implement his future story, his vision for our church. We have about uh, 380 or 90 people gathered in small groups praying. And these Monday through Friday videos are helping us to be reminded and prompted in prayer. This week, I want to f today, I want to finish this week's topic of what are the hindrances to discerning God's prayer. And I've listed uh, four, and today's the fifth one, and that's a lack of unity among God's people. Whenever God's people aren't unified together, it's no wonder they can't discern God's will. Psalm 133 says, Behold how, how uh, beautiful it is, how pleasant it is, how, how much joy it gives God when his people dwell together and unity. And when there's fussing and fighting and there's friction and bitterness and, and selfish agendas in the life of a church, it's no wonder people can't discern God's will. So let me challenge you as I challenge myself to really fight for a sense of unity. Understand that different people are going to have different preferences and, and different perspectives. Yes, of course. But we still come together as sisters and brothers in Christ. And the same Jesus that lives within you as Lord and Savior, the same Jesus that lives within me, and then our hearts can be melded together. And when churches are at odds with one another, when there's, when there's fractures and friction in the body of Christ, it's going to be really difficult to discern God's leading and God's will in a place like that. So I pray if you're out of fellowship with anybody in our church, if there's forgiveness that needs to be given, that God through his spirit would enable you to do that and that there'd be no lack of unity as a hindrance to our church discerning God's will. Let's pray together. Father, we pray on this uh, 19th day of these 40 days that you're creating a strong sense of unity in the body of Christ, which honors you. And Lord, Lord may each of us search our own hearts, and may we be right before you to that end. And we pray this in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you for tracking along this week as we've talked about the hindrances to certain God's will. We'll see you on Monday as we resume these daily prayer videos.